What's up guys, Eddie Henry XR Lifestyles discussing inflammation today. Look back over all my videos and all the papers I've written and I've noticed that I talk about chronic inflammation and how bad it is for you in every single thing I've ever done. So I just want to make sure everybody knows what I'm talking about when I say chronic inflammation. So your body to be optimal is always having to repair, recover, and heal itself through a process called cellular regeneration. And what cellular regeneration is, is when your cells get replaced with newer, healthier cells. That's how our muscles get stronger, that's how our heart gets stronger, that's how we get more optimal and grow younger. And this only happens optimally when our body is in a place called homeostasis or equilibrium. This is where you're happy, healthy, in what I call the age-free zone. And during homeostasis, there are no external factors coming in freaking you out. You're just happy and healthy, and this naturally happens while we sleep because there are no external factors coming in while we sleep, so our bodies optimally recover, heal, and regenerate. A couple things happen, though, when you wake up in the typical American world. Here's a few examples. I wake up a little bit late, so I'm stressed. So the second I get up, my adrenal glands kind of go into hyperdrive and are pumping cortisol in my body. Then I have typical American breakfast, cereal, skim milk, orange juice, pancreas, huge insulin spice is working on overdrive, digestive tract starts working, there's some GMOs and that stuff, so my body's getting a little freaked out now. I go outside, turn the car on, breathe some exhaust, now there's toxins in my body, liver's like, what am I going to do with these toxins? On my way to work, I stop and get a coffee, maybe a latte, it's very acidic. So my point is, rather now than my body optimally healing itself, it's getting sidetracked from all these external factors or from this chronic inflammation coming in. It can't heal itself because it's trying to heal the pancreas is on overdrive, the insulin, everything that's going on, the cortisol, my liver, these toxins, holy cow, it's sidetracked. So now again, rather than healing, it's putting out fires. If this is always chronically happening, then the body can never heal itself properly, can never age properly, and you find yourself in this slippery slope of never being able to heal from anything. And this is where you're gonna see in the American world all these diseases like cancer, heart disease, diabetes, and so on and so forth, when they're gonna become more prevalent because the body is unable to heal itself when it's chronically inflamed from unhealthy external factors. If we want to be lean and mean for life, if we want to have optimal health and fitness, we have to learn how to minimize these external factors so our bodies can be in equilibrium or homeostasis more often. Your body only heals properly when it's happy, healthy, and in that age-free zone. Again, homeostasis. The next couple videos, we're going to talk about anti-inflammatory techniques to help keep you in homeostasis. We're going to talk about anti-inflammatory foods and then the worst inflammatory foods. So if you like this video, like it on Facebook, subscribe to my channel at YouTube, Eddie Henry. Just always check out xrlifestyles.com for the latest news. By the way, big contest coming up, guys. If you want to compete in it, you can't be having chronic inflammation as part of your lifestyle. Got to be in homeostasis. Take care. See you soon.